name is Rogelio Gonzalez. I don't know if you guys prefer to speak in Spanish or English. Doesn't matter to me. <laughs> I think that's fine. I think. Okay. Well, um, I came here in February uh, 1990 to the United States after working for the government for 11 years. I kind of trained myself in anything that you can imagine. Uh, needs, you know, it's not an invention, so I had to. Came over here for vacation, mostly. And then I make this country my own. I love it. I feel great on it. And I see new faces every day in my community. I see also the opportunities that everybody would. And I love mechanics, so I invest my time in that. And I've been working as a mechanic for 10 years already, going to my 11th year. In this last year, I decided to open a serious business. So I went and registered with the state and done all the stuff that they asked me to do. And finally, I went and rent a place, and I'm working there. Like pretty much everything that she said is everything that I am. Because that, as long as she was talking, I mean, kind of let me not need to think about it. She was right there. But the more important thing I see is you kind of have to put your, your entrepreneur hat. You know, it's a hat with a little door hanging in front of it, whatever you want. It's there. Not just because you pursue your dollar, but you pursue your dream, or in this case, it's not a dream for me, it's a way of living, that's what I feel, that's what I think, that's what I want to get up tomorrow to do, and it's not about money, um, it's just there, it's like you said, it's something that makes you wake up every morning and go on, uh, sometimes it's not good, sometimes you feel like, oh gosh, is this going to be, uh, I, I want to change Direction, but then you wake up next day. It's there. It doesn't, it doesn't leave you alone. You gotta keep going. In any case, after you pass all those things and go on with your life, uh, you find out reality and oh, I need money for this, I need money for that, I need money for here. And you don't have any money because you left your job and everything. Or you just came out with a lot of money and then you start doing that that you like. And you start accumulating, like she said, when oh, I got the box of tools and I got the new car and I got the truck and so on. And uh, sometimes weigh you down and so on. There's times it just give you that a push to keep going. And this is what it does to me. And um, coming back to the point, you know, looking for money, you go to see who can help you with money. For a Latino, very small to me until I found it. And they kind of opened the door for me, but also they ask you, you know, hey, we need to meet these requirements, which is good because mostly our requirements are about discipline. Yeah. And that is important because you cannot just raise your hand to anybody without knowing that person is home. And that's what it comes to being a real entrepreneur or a dreamer. Dreamers, there's a bunch around there.